you know, I, so did see some things there. Some I saw some assignments executed pretty well. Others not so well. So we improved on that. Worked on that all week. Um, you know, I really saw the safeties do a good job of tackling the ball, getting the running back down. I'd like to see that a little bit more with the corners on the outside. Um, but I want to eliminate the big plays. You know, they had too many big plays in the first half. Um, we can't allow good teams like about to face Eastern Michigan. They have really good offense. They have really sound defense. Uh, we can't afford to give them, you know, free points or free yards. So we got to really buckle down, communicate well, um, and, and execute our assignments a lot better early on. And then when we get an opportunity to, to capitalize on it and make, you know, put them in a position to throw us the ball, we got to finish well. Are those same goals that the teams uh, improve most from first game to second game. You expect that type of improvement? Well, you know, you always do. Every year you expect to, yeah, to see right. some some changes, but so does the other team you're playing yeah, too. Sure. You know, so they're not going to make the same mistakes. They're going to have a couple of little yeah, wrinkles. Right. They're going to change up a little bit of what they do, and we've got to really apply our rules. I talked to the guys today about it. Just apply the rules to what we have. You're going to see something unusual. Last time we played Eastern Michigan, they, they had a couple trick plays. You know, they had a couple unusual formations, things we hadn't seen before on film. Um, since then, we've learned, so be ready to see anything, but just apply your rules. So, you know, I expect to see some improvement, especially, you know, on the, you know, just on the assignment end of it, you know, not blowing assignments mentally, you know, and then in the physical situation, that's what they're here for. Uh, to teach them the technique, execute the technique. Now it's time for you to win your one-on-one, -on -one, and that's something that the great players do. So I'd like to see them go out and continue to do that. With them knowing that you're a little inexperienced on the back end, would you expect to uh, to maybe be at risk for even more of those kind of deceptive no. type plays? You know, everybody says that, but last year I remember playing uh, Florida and they threw the ball in Missouri three, four straight times on the fade on the corners that's playing in the NFL right now, you know? So they're going to see what we do and they're going to try to execute what they want to do. And they're going to see if a single high safety, two safeties, and then they're going to, you know, go what they've always done. They're going to test the secondary course so they can set up the run. You know, back those safeties up. Our safeties are aggressive. They do well tackling the ball. They're going to make those guys cover, and then they're going to give a, put us in a situation where, you know, we've got to make plays on the ball in the air and come down and make tackles on the running back. So you just got to do a good job as a coach of preparing your guys for that. So, you know, as far as them attacking us, yeah, I expect everybody to attack us. You know, and at the end of the day, that's it's been the same way for 20 years of me coaching. So, you know, we just go out every, every day and be prepared for that. We expect it. Yusuf had a good game on paper, but how did you evaluate his, his first game? I thought he did pretty well. I thought he tackled well. Uh, he started communicating well. He, he did a good job of taking control. He and Jordan Griffin did a good job of taking control of the secondary and putting guys where they were supposed to be. Um, so I, I really liked his leadership You know, after the second quarter. Um, I saw it improving as the game went on. So, you know, just, just got to keep pushing. You know, we'll keep pushing, make some plays on the ball in the passing game, and then continue to make those tackles he made but continue to build him as a leader and as one of our, our, our better players back there. Last 